Hey everybody, have you ever wanted to have TTS on your stream, something like this? Hello world. With just a stream elements widget? Well, if so, keep on watching the video and I'll show you how to do it. The first thing you should do is if you haven't already, please watch my how to add a custom stream elements widget video because that will explain most of how this stuff works. The first thing we need to do is create a new overlay or you can add this widget to your existing overlay. It doesn't really matter to me. I'll leave that up to you. But for purposes of this video, I am going to be creating a new overlay. You go in here, you add the custom widget and then we go to the editor. So this will be in my GitHub page, github.com slash wolcat slash se widgets and it will be under the TTS folder. So once you go into the TTS folder, you go through and you will be copying all of these. I don't have any CSS, so you don't have to copy that. Then you hit done. So now you'll see you have the command. There are some banned words. This TTS widget will also respect any words that you have banned on Twitch. So that's pretty nice. You can choose who you want to be able to do this and then the volume and then the voice. So some of these voices don't work, but these are all the voices from AWS. You'll just have to kind of experiment with who you like the best. I also added a new feature. So if somebody raids you, you can have it so that their messages will automatically use TTS. So this is really helpful, like, because when, you know, you get a raid, everybody is talking all the time and usually spamming a bunch of crazy stuff. And it can be kind of hard to connect with the person who has actually raided you. If you turn this on, you can control how long they are going to be TTS for. And you can also choose the minimum number of raiders. So you won't get people who like raid you with just one and, you know, just to be funny. So they have free TTS. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this widget. If you have any questions or find any bugs, please let me know and I'll see you guys later. Bye.